السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته I am engineer محمد مجدي and we will take about welding process welding technology book chapter 3 we will start with introduction introduction since the welding inspector is primarily concerned with welding knowledge of various joining and the cutting process can be very helpful welding inspector should know about welding and the cutting process Something like car driving lessons. Driver should know about road instruction. Okay. Same for certified welding inspector. He should know about welding and about cutting. He can't do his job perfectly without knowing about welding and cutting. Okay. While it is not mandatory that the inspector be a qualified welder, any hands on welding experiences is beneficially. There are a certain aspect of the various joining and the cutting process which the successful welding inspector must understand in order to perform most effectively. First, the inspector should realize the important advantage and the limitation of each process. For example, when you want to buy a new mobile, so you need to know the advantage and the limitation of each mobile to select the proper one. Same in welding. To select the proper welding process, you should know advantage, also limitation of each process. Also welding discontinuity result from each process. For example, when we need to weld a critical piping, small diameter with a stainless steel pipe, we can use gas tungsten arc welding. It is very clean and the high good quality process. Even it is a low productivity process. When we are going to a pipeline project, we may use shield metal arc welding. It is more productivity than gas tungsten arc welding with lower quality than gas tungsten arc welding. So, you select the proper welding process according to situation, according to uh, material, and according to equipment. Okay. This is, uh, this is shield metal arc welding. And this is gas tungsten arc welding. Very, very clean process, which you can use in a space and use in food and the medicine processing industry.